this mysterious rock has scientists stumped. The Chang'e 4 lander and the U-2-2 rover have started exploring the lunar terrain once again. This was after the robotics went into a state of hibernation, and this was due to cold lunar nights. Its most recent discovery comes in the form of a mysterious looking rock, which researchers have said is an exciting discovery. This strange rock was soon referred to as a milestone, with the China National Space Administration and mission scientists agreeing that further inspection of the rock was needed. According to the team, they have said they aim to go in for a closer look, and that they will analyse the rock using the visible and near-infrared imaging spectrometer instrument. This instrument has been used in the past to investigate other strange-looking rocks. Dan Moriarty, NASA's postdoctoral program fellow at the Goddard Space Flight Center in Greenbound, said the following to Space.com. Repeated impact stresses from thermal cycling and other forms of weathering on the lunar surface would all tend to break down rocks into more or less spherical shapes, given enough time. I would definitely guess an origin as impact ejector from some nearby crater. End quote. In recent years, there's been a lot of special interest in the dark side of the moon. This popular term refers to the fact that the same physical half of the moon is always facing Earth, which in turn means there's a dark side. One of the most recent announcements to come from the mission was that another Chinese rover had discovered a strange gel-like substance. At the time, it wasn't known what the gel was, causing various people to put forward their theories for what they thought it could be. However, it's now been announced by scientists that they figured out what the substance was. It turns out that the gel comes from the many rocks that can be found on the surface. Scientists went on to say this gel-like substance was likely created when rocks melted together. This could have happened when a meteorite struck the surface of the moon, causing a massive amount of heat to melt the surrounding rocks. The strange gel was discovered back in July of 2019. Chinese officials stated this find was strange, as you don't normally find something like this on the moon. Photographs soon started to make the rounds which showed a part of the moon that looked glossy. Scientists then said that after more detailed photographs were sent back, they backed up their theory that this substance was created by intense heat. This research was published in the Earth and Planetary Science Letters. China has been making some great strides when it comes to space. On January 3, 2019 at around 10.26am Beijing time, China's robot spacecraft successfully landed on the far side of the moon. The spacecraft Chang'e 4 puts China in the running for a space leader, as it's the first in history to land in the South Pole at Kim Basin, which is an area of the moon that is never visible to Earth. This dark side of the moon is unexplored territory. No one has attempted to reach it before. The moon is the Earth's only natural satellite, rotating every 27 days or so. We actually are only able to see approximately 60% of the moon's surface. The 40% of the dark side of the moon is always hidden away from us. The National Aeronautics and Space Administration has spent the past 50 years collecting images of the far side of the moon, and this is through satellites and other space probes. So, although we have known for some time what the other side roughly looks like, this landing makes history and will reveal even more detailed information about the moon and space that we did not know prior. There is no direct communication link to the robotic spacecraft, so in order for the lunar images it captured to reach Earth, it has to be rerouted through another satellite that China recently launched prior to this mission. Chang'e 4 was launched on December 7, 2018, and arrived in the moon's orbit five days later. It then took the rest of the month to lower itself onto the surface. Named after a Chinese goddess who supposedly lived for millennia on the moon, its mission is to explore the massive South Pole Atkin Basin. This basin is one of the largest known impact craters in our whole solar system. The distance from its tallest peak to its very depths is nearly 15 kilometers, or 9.3 miles. 
To put that into perspective, Mount Everest measures around 9.8 kilometers or 5.5 miles. Chang'e 4 will collect soil samples to analyze the structure and composition of the moon above and below its surface. What's even more amazing is that the Chang'e 4 brought live plant species from Earth that it will use to plant a garden. It carries cotton rapeseed potato yeast and the small flowering plant Arabidopsis. Apart from gathering samples and data, its other mission is to attempt to grow the first plants on the moon. The China National Space Administration also explained that since there is no radio interference on the dark side, there is opportunity for the spacecraft to observe the stars and nebula using radio astronomy. Even though the moon has been explored since the 1960s, there is still so much information still unknown to us. China first announced its moon landing plan back in 2016. Their space program has grown incredibly quick since their first astronaut launching in 2003, and over time they managed to send multiple robotic spacecrafts onto the moon. They've also launched various satellites and space stations, and even a Mars rover. It's amazing to think how far we've come technologically. China has also revealed their plans to create a nuclear fusion reactor that will reach extreme temperatures similar to those found at the sun's core. They claim that their artificial sun will be able to burn up to 360 million degrees Fahrenheit, around 12 times hotter than our sun. Nuclear fusion on the sun occurs when two hydrogen nuclei fuse together to form a heavier helium nucleus, thus releasing an intense amount of energy during the process. Their device is called the Experimental Advanced Superconducting Tokamak. A tokamak is a ring-shaped device in which the hydrogen is heated to extreme temperatures and turns into plasma. So what do you make of these recent projects and discoveries? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.